One of the competitors was Sandy Northrup. Sandy, where are you? Sandy's birthday today. Yay! And what do we do on people's birthday? Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Sandy. Happy birthday to you. Okay, um, so here we are in our, our final mug of the day, uh, last day of racing. I hope you've had a, all had a great time here uh, in this great little drinking town of Bangor that also has a sailing problem. Um, certainly, uh, you all look as if you've enjoyed yourselves. Good effort. <laughs> um, Mug of the day. We, we haven't had a great deal of, of nominations today, but we've, we've got a couple. Um, Julie from Denman, one of our lead sponsors. Is Julie here? She's here. Yes. Julie. Uh, Julie was in the North Slip duties this afternoon, and uh, she was helping out. She pushed the trolley underneath the boat, uh, but she couldn't get out again because the boat crew kept pushing the boat on top of her. Uh, so she was crawling back up the water to try and get out up the North Slip. <laughs> Um, it wasn't as if she was going to sink or anything. There's a bit of buoyancy around Julie, you know. Uh, so, <laughs> so she's all good. <laughs> um, Ron Hutchison. Uh, Ron Hutchison was on the jury. Uh, an ex Commodore of Bally Home Yacht Club. Is Ron, Ron available to say about tonight? Ron? Oh, he must say, well, he, he parked his car blocking in the trailer park and uh, someone had to take their trailer apart to get it out of the trailer park. So, well done, Ron. Um, uh, just, we don't really condone this. Freddie White and Sebastian Samways, they here? Freddie and Sebastian? Where are they? Come on, up you go. Come on. Freddie and Sebastian, uh, work with a very good friend of our club, uh, Philip Johnson, and you all know Jackson 5, Philip Johnson. Um, come on, I need both of you. Come on. Sam Sam Samway. Is he not here? He's not here. Guys, seriously, come on. Other Sam then. Hey, today. Um, Philly reliably informs me that you guys think is her. It's a different Sam, he's standing. <laughs> Big English drinkers, should I say? So he actually calls you Southern Pifters, but <laughs> there you go, boys. There you go. Get Philly Dawson, I'm sure you'll be soon to be impressed and you'll be up for the next promotion in Artemis. Um, with a couple of uh, bits and pieces going on today, uh, boat 1579, uh, British boat, uh, hit the last mark on the last lap in the last race, having to take turns, so it's a bit embarrassing for them, you know, uh, how did you regard a finish, doing turns in the finish line, you know. Um, we, uh, we also had a, a couple of yeah. <laughs> we also had a couple of collisions out in the racetrack today with the French boats, two French boats colliding. Um, but we uh, it, uh, mug of the day has to go to our very own Adrian Allen. Uh, Adrian uh, on the pre-start jived at the start line, forgot to duck. What do you learn when you're still in the boat? Oh, tack. Jive. No. Um, Barry shouted duck and Adrian said yes please. Uh, so, uh, needless to say, uh, he got a whack on the side of the head with, with the boom. 
and uh, from what I understand, he was a bit sort of fuzzy and wishy-washy and zigzagging up over start lines and stuff, and it just really wasn't working out until he had to be brought ashore, checked out by the medics, and given a wee cup of tea and a donut. <laughs> <laughs> so, for that, uh, I call Adrian and Barry. <laughs> Green Barry, there is your mug. There are certainly mugs of the day. Barry, I'm going to give you that. And I've got Adrian a very special type of hat this evening. indeed for, for participating in Mug of the Day and thanks for giving me all your stories from on and off the water and um, it's helped to make the event. Thanks very much.